very insightful speech. Thank you for that. If you should pick up one key message out of that, what would it be? Um, so what we see now during the crisis, yeah, like an e-commerce crisis is coming up after we had the travel crisis, the companies have to be more efficient. Yeah? So efficiency will rise, lower budgets will rise. So um, companies will start working on their, their meeting performance and start ways how they, with a lower budget, analyze their, their customers, their, their audience, new markets they want to go for. And finally, for this audience, they also have to produce more, more content, new content. Um, but on a lower budget, you have to think about ways how to scale translations, how to scale um, text content, how to produce maybe with AIs, uh, picture content, video content, even storylines are possible with AI at the moment. So that's what I'm seeing uh, for the next 24 months. We are very happy to have you here. How do you like e-commerce jam? What do you think about it? Um, that's my first time in Zagreb. A friend of mine referred me. Uh, I had the best seafood since years. Yeah, um, everybody is taller than me, looks better than me, and probably is even smarter. But I'm older and have more experience. Uh, so uh, it's uh, it's one of the best events so far. Yeah, I've seen um, the venue place is great. Um, the LED is better than all the beamers uh, I've seen in the past years. Uh, I like the Nike Zalano sessions. Um, my counterparts here are great. So yeah, it's a great event. Uh, past few years uh, were very challenging. Covid times, after Covid times, potential crisis and this kind of stuff. And it seems that the future is gonna be even more demanding. If you should share with us one uh, message, one business idea for the future, what would it be? It's not my idea, but I have a great advice for everyone. Uh, as uh, we traveled through the crisis uh, in the travel industry the last two and a half years, and since the beginning of the year, we are um, back to, um, to a strong growth path. The one thing we did great r retrospective looking backwards was that we focused only on one goal. Yeah, so we only had one objective. If you work with objective and key results, we, we shrinked it down from four um, yearly objectives to only one. Yeah? Let's call it um, survive. Yeah? So if, you, if you're in a crisis, uh, like, a, like in every kind of business, even in, in, in marathons, in sports, everywhere, if you focus on a one single goal and align all the employees you still have there um, on that one, then probably you have the highest possibility, the highest chance to survive the crisis. 